it's Krista and Robert. Say hey, Robert. Uh, deals estate sales here. Uh, we've been working all day on a sale that starts uh, November 29th through, I believe, it's December 2nd. Uh, we thought we would be able to get it done early, but as it turns out, not going that way. Um, we usually get things done early, but this one is proving to be a little bit of a bear. So we are working away and we're almost there. Perhaps two more days to get the house in the condition we'd like it to be in before we start photographing and pricing. So um, this is the Oklahoma Ladies Sale. Not for ladies, but the Oklahoma Ladies Jewelry. Uh, the one I've been putting on YouTube, it's her home. Um, I may do more of that tonight. I have still have several bags to go, uh, bags and boxes full of stuff. Uh, thank you to everybody that's been uh, leaving comments and subscribing and and look, going on you on to eBay and purchasing the jewelry. Um, thank you so much, I've been for our repeat customers. I really appreciate you. Um, some more interesting things that I saw through some clear bags, but again, there's so much of it, I have no idea what's there. So, I think I'll do a video when I get home. Um, yeah, because we have relatives coming in a few days on Saturday, and I don't suspect that I'll be, well, I might try to make some shorts while we're here, while we're, we're entertaining and, and going places with my two cousins. Um, but uh, for the most part, I don't think I'll be doing any big jewelry videos, episodes. Um, but the following next week, I will, midweek or so. But anyway, we'll see you in a bit. Bye for now. Hi, everybody. It's Krista. I'm back. I'm at home now. Robert is over there making himself a salad and uh, some, some Greek bean soup, warming it up that my mom made the other night yesterday um so i have some more jewelry for you I, um i have these two bag full of stuff i don't know what's there just what i can see through it which is not a whole lot so i don't know you know am i getting more to the costume or is it still really high quality let's see what we have in the first little bank bag okay that's pretty Mother of Pearl and appears to be an opal set in the center. Pendant with a steel wire, gold steel wire, probably just not gold, but Mother of Pearl, really pretty flower with an opal in the middle. Now remember to subscribe if you like what we're doing here. Um, we always have something interesting. And let me know in the comments what you'd like to see on my eBay channel, which is Lemon Icebox Pie. That is in our um, our description of our channel, if you forget uh, from here, from where I'm telling you. Um, next item up is a Sterling Silver Grapes, Clusters of Grapes, and that does have a mark. A nice big mark on it let's see what I can see 95 oh, I can't read it oh I think it's Mexico yep so Mexico sterling great bracelet first two pieces are really nice Okay. Okay, I'm saying okay again. Got a whole bunch of things in this little bag. Let's see what what it is. Okay, another little bank bag, but it's full of stuff. Okay. Two big beads. So I do have some beads if you're interested. Um a sterling silver pen, pin, brooch. It looks like it's got some patina greenish color in there. So, 
It's a sterling piece. Okay, another set of collar points uh, for your for your shirt, and these are sterling as well, western for your western shirts. I have a what I looks to be a new um, sterling chain. Let me put a bunch of this together, a few pieces together and sell them. So that still is new with the tag and that's silver. Okay, here's a bone or ivory piece and it is a pin or a brooch. Nice smaller pieces that won't be too expensive. Okay, this is 925 sterling jewelry and it is a pendant with that blue stone in the middle, which you all may know what it is. Let me know what it is. I think I know what it is, but I'm gonna I'm gonna butcher the word, so I'm just not gonna say it. And here we go. I've got a pair of sterling Native American earrings with, oh, one is missing the, um, easy to replace though. I don't have the, uh, the, the earring. Oh yeah, I do. Here it is. It get, got caught. Okay, let me put that back on there. Let me fix that. I'll fix that later. Let me show you what the earrings is. Bear with the turquoise, a little bit of coral, probably onyx in there, Native American. And they are um, signed and they say sterling. Okay. This is a very bright and fun piece. It is all, these are glass beads. It is a choker, very, very bright and funky. If you like something different and eye-catching. Another little bank bag. This must be the sterling silver bag. Okay, this one is signed. For a sterling. Uh, old-fashioned uh, piece looking looks like silverware it, it's a brooch so that's sterling and then I have this piece which does not look like sterling it's just costume with the Greek key design around it amethyst beads single strand if you have a small enough neck well you can always double it you can double it to some degree I guess really pretty it has a purple knotted um, string that's pretty next little bank bag Tasha worked at the bank These are some nice earrings. They are older. Let me see what they say. Whiting and Davis Company. Big gold glass stones and Whiting and Davis earrings. A cuff bracelet signed. It is a Thomas Singer. Great. We love Thomas Singer. Thomas Singer, Native American um, artist, sterling silver bracelet, cuff. So that is a nice piece. Thomas Singer. The little village, the wagon, little adobes, little houses. Bank bag. 
And we have a vintage brooch with black jet cut rhinestones. That solid color of black with the black rhinestones around everything. I don't see a mark, but if I do find a mark, I'll put it in the description. If you see anything you like, let me know, and I will put it on eBay first. This is a costume bracelet. It's got some corrosion on it. So I do not think I would put that on on uh, eBay. And another bracelet. It is a toggle silver tone. Almost has a Brighton look to it. Not sure that it is. But again, I'll let you know if I see the mark. And we just have some. That necklace is not good. What else do we have down in here? I have a silver bracelet. And it is signed. I mean, it's marked. I'm not sure that it's signed. 925. birds on it. Again, kind of Native American. And here we go. We have a, I think it says Johnson Sterling Lapis Bracelet. And it is written on the back, $3.95, and it's Lapis. Let me see what it is. W. Johnson is the designer. So that is a is a nice piece. Not sure who, I guess whoever she bought it from wrote in it, on it. Okay. This is a nice pendant. Let me see who, all the stones. It does have, it has missing stones. So it could show, it's a Florenza brand. It would be nice if all the stones were there. This could show up in just a grouping of, of items that I'll put on eBay. I'm going, to do, I'm going to be doing that with some of, this, of these items. And this one is, can't see. Czechoslovakia, made in Czechoslovakia. It's an older piece. It has a little bit of uh, tarnish on it, discoloration, but it's a nice older, older pin brooch. Okay. This looks like uh, could be. 14 karat, it's earrings, pearl, pink pearl, and a pearl, and my cat just came around because her name is Pearl, a little pendant. And what else do we have? This is a kind of a neat bracelet. I'm sure that this is it is 925 sterling. It is a slide bracelet. So the, the uh, pieces just slide along. Heart, oval, flower, different shapes. And it has the closure on, e on that side. And a little chain, safety, safety chain. Let me know if you like that. That is sterling. This is pretty. It is a malachite heart pendant. Come on out of the bag. There we go. Just a heart. Very pretty. Green. Simple. Matches my, my shirt today. 
very nice. Okay, that's all we have in the first bag. Now let's let's start with the second bag. Let's start with this little yellow pouch. What do we have? A bracelet. It's just beaded with wood. It's a costume piece. I don't know where I was showing somebody over here. Costume piece. And the little tag says Eric and Mike made in Bali. Okay, no, Pearl. Here's a crystal. A crystal two strand necklace. Vintage, older piece. Let me know if you're interested. Really pretty. Okay. Somebody told me I was boring the other day. I'm sorry if I'm boring. What do we have here? Okay, this looks like jasper or green stones. Green and yellow and rust, and I'm going to guess jasper. Although I could be wrong, but let me show you up close. What do y'all think that is? Just kind of green and gold. Big, cold beads, choker style. Okay, these are these are bead strands. Let's see what this is. Beads. What do we have here? Yep, these say fourteen karat pearl with opals around them that's older it's it's discolored the the um earring holder but the earrings themselves are really nice let's show you up close pearl and opal so it's 14k oh and here is a pretty stone and these are again 14k they are gold and here's the matching pendant so 14 karat gold with the blue and green swirly stones which i don't think is lapis is something else let me know what you think that is okay Let's see what this is. Oh, it's a big old chunky, chunky, chunky necklace. It's a turquoise and big, big coral beads. Looks like that with a toggle. Big necklace. That is a statement piece. Let me know if you like it. And let's see what else we have. We don't have too much left. Some pins that don't appear to be real. They're just silver in color. Some older beads. And here are three bracelets. So that's kind of pretty. It's kind of swirly with different colors in it. It's kind of like a... It's signed. Alex... It's signed Alex Batar, Alexis Batar. Pretty that one, and this is this is the same brand, Alexis Batar. Really pretty. And then one smaller one has a purplish. Well, they all have a bluish and gold hues running through them on different sides. Really unusual and pretty. 
So I'll save that that bag with these bracelets. And what else do we have? We have a I have a tiger's eye. The last thing for the night is a tiger's eye pendant. Tiger iron. It says tiger iron. I don't know what that means. So, nice pendant. And let's see. Do you have some bead strands? Chelsea, Chelsea Donnie? How do you say that? that and we have these chalidoni and those are beads ready to be strung on your own necklaces so I could put uh, these two together if you'd like just let me know that you'd like the beads and I think there's one more strand a little bit different so we have this one as well. So we could put all three of these together in one auction, well not auction, buy it now with the best offer. So if you make jewelry, those are really pretty too. So I hope that you liked today's, this evening's quick little uh, video. Um, like I said earlier today, we will ha be having company, so I'm not sure how much I'm going to be able to be on um, doing this, but I'm going to do my best, and I'll probably put a few on every day over the next few days. I'll, I'll put a few items on. Um, let me know down in the comments what you would like to see first, and of course, I'm still working on the other stuff. I just have to get these videos out there, and, um, and in the meantime, just be working on all the the collection. So if you see a video, previous video, and there's something that you want to see, let me know. You can let me know here, let me know on those videos, and I will definitely am trying to get through all of it. And the, the, the better pieces will be on eBay, and the ones that are not so fantastic, I'll probably just sell them at the estate sale or and or, and or do them as a group on, on eBay. So let me know. Um, thanks for looking and thanks for watching and thanks for stopping in and uh, if you like us, subscribe and give us a thumbs up. So y'all have a great night and time for me to go feed these cats because they're coming. They're coming at me. I have three around me right now. So I'm going to go take care of them. So y'all have a great evening. Peace out. Bye.